We found it, a Perkins restaurant and bakery here in Western Pennsylvania. Come on along and join us as me and Michelle get something really good to eat. Another good hit with the buffalo. Good job. She's on a roll more than me. She gets the strike. All right. Oh boy. Oh, that looks good. Finding this location was an awesome bonus on our way out to Connecticut because in Ohio, a lot of the Perkins restaurants are disappearing. So when I saw this, I just said, hey, Michelle, we got to check this out because you never know when we may find another one that we could go to. If you guys know of any Perkins pancakes that you guys go to and have had good experiences, let me know about it in the comments because we're always looking for a cool place to go eat and Perkins is one of those places that I feel is iconic so okay we are here today at Perkins Pancake in Clinton Pennsylvania and Michelle and me have decided to pull off on our way to Foxwoods and get breakfast I think um I decided to go with the ham and cheese crepes. Okay. Does that include the the, the yeah, vegetables? It comes with fruit and it comes with a potato. You want the chunky or shredded? The shredded. Okay. And what did you go with, Michelle? I'm going with the eggs benedict, the classic. Okay. Hash browns or breakfast potatoes? Um, hash browns. Okay. Awesome. I will get it right out. Oh, thank you. Sorry. No There's a lot of menus for one restaurant. I know. <laughs> thank you. All right, we got the order in, and I'll bring you guys back when the food comes. I've always wanted to go to a Perkins pancake. It's been hard to find one that actually still is operational because in Ohio, they're shutting a lot of them down. So here we are in Clinton, PA, trying Perkins pancake. Are you excited, Michelle? Oh, yes, I am. All right, I've never had crepes before, so this is gonna be interesting, okay. Here's their piece. This is why they call Perkins a bakery because they actually have really awesome bakery here. I always used to call it Perkins pancake, but I'm old school when it comes to that. And there's some pies down here. Awesome. Ooh, they got a sugar-free cookie one over there. Very cool. Wild, wild berry pie, cherry pie, and caramel apple pie. All right. Okay, so Michelle went with the Eggs Benedict. What made you decide to go with Eggs Benedict? Because I've been craving it since the Blue Colony Diner in Newtown, uh, Connecticut. Yeah, and I was the one that got the Eggs Benedict instead. Correct. And I went with the crepes because I've never had them before. So we're going to see what... It's what the fuss is all about. <laughs> it's a limited time thing, I believe they have that menu with uh, for the summer, I think. So I figured, why not give it a shot? What flavor did you get? Ham and cheese. Ham. And it comes with a side of fruit. So I'm gonna be fruity today. All, all right. right. Someone's having a, a birthday celebration here. That was cool. Yeah. Thank you, Benedict. Awesome. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you well did done. good. All Thank right. You. Wow, look at that. Holland. Wow, Michelle. <laughs> you want to turn that around, or are you going to look at it from that way? There you go. And this is what crepes look like. I think that's a little bit of sour cream on top of there. Okay. There's the, the cheese, and then there's the egg inside of that, and the ham. 
And you got a, your own little bowl of fruit too, Michelle. Mm -hmm. And look at that holiday sauce. Yeah. Are you excited? Oh yeah. All right. Okay, let's try this together here. I'm gonna go with. Cut that over there. I'm not gonna try to pick it up with my hand because I know it will end up being a disaster. I'm gonna get that ham. Okay. You can taste everything. It's good, real good. Everything in this is something that I like. And um, it's good. I love how the, the cheese goat mixes with it and the ham and the egg and a little dab of sour cream in there. Mm -hmm. And she has it with some hash browns. Mm. Real good. Let's try some fruit. Oh yeah. It's cold and crisp. Real good. Okay, there's Michelle with her eggs benedict. Go ahead, give it a shot. What do you think? I always ask her when she still has the food in her mouth. But that's got the hollandaise sauce on there. And it's, what, it's like an English muffin on that too. Mm -hmm. Poached egg. They had a California avocado benedict and it had avocado in it. Oh, that would have been good too. Mm -hmm. Did, are you glad you got it now though? Yes, I am. Yeah. Satisfied my craving. Yeah, the crepes is really good. Let's give it another. Right there. There we go. Real good. One thing I want to say when you're eating something like this that's got so much you know, cheese and ham and, and sour cream, it's good, really good to chase it with a fruit afterwards because it helps it all go down so much easier. Really good. I, isn't that fruit good? It's, I love how it's nice and chilled and everything. And, 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 and firm, not yeah. soggy, fresh. It all goes really well together. Perkins Bakery in Clinton, Pennsylvania. When we got in here, that whole area was packed with people. And we were really worried about how long it was going to take. But we got seated right away. And this whole area has been very efficient that the workers here have gotten the food out very quickly and it's been a very pleasant experience everyone seems to be in a good mood here the the servers and the the, the staff very professional and helpful doing a very good job here and i highly recommend checking out this location here in clinton pennsylvania perkins bakery they really did a nice job wouldn't you say, Michelle? Very good. Yeah. Hey, I wanted to give you a quick side note. The actual location of this Perkins is Matamoros, Pennsylvania, not Clinton. I really screwed up when I was Google searching this. So here's Michelle. So what did you think? It is actually Matamoros. Matamoros? Matamoros, Pennsylvania, not Clinton. That's okay. Sorry about that, everyone. But anyway, what did you think of this Perkins Pancake or Perkins Restaurant and Bakery here in Matamoros? I can't even say it right. Pennsylvania. It was delicious. It was well worth it, you know. It was good, you know. It satisfied my hunger. 
I feel bad that I kept on saying Clinton the whole time that you met someone in there. I met a lot of ladies, uh, ones from New York and then ones going home to Connecticut. She just got back from Las Vegas, seeing her granddaughter get married. Okay. And well, it, it was a family friendly environment in there, wasn't it? Yes, it was, you know, and, and the service was fantastic for being shorthanded. They got yeah. us in and out of there in what, a half hour? That, yeah. That's not bad. Hey, you know. Well, there you go.